Hey! Hi! Hello! Howdy! How are you? Happy Wednesday! Uh, glutes and core. We're gonna do it Tabata in Tabata rounds today. Uh, I don't. We haven't. I don't think we've done glutes and core Tabata style in a while. So that's what we're gonna do. Um, as far as equipment goes, if you have a glute band, please have it handy. Um, also have uh, at least one set of dumbbells, if not maybe a variety. Uh, if you're not familiar, Tabata is the 20 seconds of work followed by 10 seconds of rest, eight rounds per block. It equals about four minutes of work. All right, let's get going. All right, march it out. Deep breath in, let that go. One more time. And left step tap in four, three, two, step tap, side to side. Also forgot to mention, uh, no cardio today. It's all just lower body and core. Four. Three, two, make it a ham curl. From the get-go, guys, keep your core tight the entire time. I will remind you a bunch. Four, three, two, back to the step tap for eight, six, four, three, two, ham curl for eight, six, four, three, two, step tap for four, two, ham curl, four, three, two, step tap last time, four, three, two, and ham curl for four, two, plant, hip thrust, and hinge. Hold this one down. Roll it up and roll your hips one way. Pause, take that the other way. Widen it out just a little bit more and double rock. Hold it. Other side. Good. Go back to the first side. Turn that into your runner's lunge. Sit back on that foot. Good, come on up into our shortened triangle and fall over that leg. Roll it up, go into your swing and hinge. Hold this one down. Good, come on up, face the center, goal post arms and twist. Four, three, two, take it back wide. Good, hold it down on side number two and drop that into your runner's lunge. Sit back on that heel. All right, guys, all right. All right, all right, all right. Good, bring that up into your shortened triangle, fall over that leg. Start your swing and hinge. Hold it down. Roll that up, 
take any last little wiggles, shakes. Let's get going. All right, uh, number one, we're gonna go for banded squats with a glute lift. You can absolutely hold weight if you'd like to, um, or go weightless. And then we're gonna drop it down and go into our double leg pulls. So those are our two exercises. Let's get going. I'm going to start with just the band, regular stop, squat stance. Here we go. Nice and low, push the band away. Don't let it pull your knees in. Actively fight against it. Squeeze that corridor, abs tight. Sit on those heels. Last one. All right. I think we'll add weight on the next one. Come on down. You can have one heel down or hover. Double pull, pull. Get those shoulder blades up. Last one, come back up. All right, I'm gonna hold one weight, heart center, keeping the band. Here we go. Nice and deep. Last one. Nice, come on down. All right, heel down or hover, let's go. Double pull, shoulder blades up. So if your heels are down, you're right here. Fight the band. Last one, come on up. Back to our squats. Here we go. Fight the band. Squeeze that quarter. What happened to your abs? Pull them back in. Last one, drop it down. Get ready. Here we go. Tail side to side. Last one. Going into our last round. Strong till the end. Fight the band, let's go. Almost there. Last one, drop it down. Here we go. Shoulder blades up. Last one. Nicely done. Remove your band. And take a minute recovery here. Grab some water. All right. We're gonna go for lateral lunges. Now you have a couple options. 
you can either return to center or you can stay out and push away. We're gonna go one side, the other side. So round, instead of doing leg then ab, we're gonna go one side, one side. We'll drop it down, baby seal, baby seal. Stand back up, leg, leg, then ab, ab, okay? That's how it's gonna go. So I think for the first round, I'm gonna do the lat lunge pushaways. So pick a side, open it up, here we go. Land soft, get low, booty back. Chest lifted, abs tight. One more and switch, shake it, shake it out. We're gonna open it to the other side. Same thing, prepare and go. Land soft, squeeze that quarter. Last one, bring it down. Baby seals, level one, you go one leg at a time. Level two, we double it up. Here we go. Big stretch here at the bottom, get a big space and then crunch it up. One more. Flip flop to the other side. Whatever level you did on one, we now do on two. Let's go. Big stretch here and then crunch. Come on up. All right, I'm gonna keep with the lat pushaways because they feel good. But you can absolutely be holding weight and return all the way to center. Remember, land soft, soft and deep. Sticking that booty back. One more. Other side. Deep breath, prepare. Go. This is our last time for legs. What happened to your abs? Pull them back in. Pick that quarter back up. Let's get one more. Nicely done, drop it down. Abs, and then we're done with this round. Here we go. Last one. A lip flop. Last thing, and we'll take our break. Here we go. Last one. Nicely done. Grab some water, long recovery here. All right, we're gonna go into 
a curtsy lunge. Now, if the curtsy lunge does not work for you, totally fine. Just take a reverse lunge on your train tracks. Your option, you can just come to standing or you can add a side knee. We're gonna go leg, leg. We're gonna drop it down and we'll go plank, side knee, plank, other side knee. So leg, leg, ab, ab, just like we just did, okay? I think I am gonna hold one weight up overhead. And when we come into the knee, that'll be almost like a weighted uh, standing crunch, okay? So if you're gonna go for the weight, hold it up, let's go. So you can either come right here or you can add that side knee. Try to make it one smooth motion. One more. All right, shake it out. Other side. Remember we go leg, leg. Weight up. Here we go. Abs super tight here, especially if you have this weight up overhead. This was our last one. Drop it down. From the knees, you're gonna go knee, knee. Hands, same thing. Hips low, abs tight. One more. Quick rest. All right, other side. Here we go. Knee to elbow. One more. Come on up. Back to legs. We're halfway. Weight up. Let's go. Whoa. Last one. All right, rest your arms for a second. Last time, other side. Here we go. Last one. All right, drop that down. Back to our side knee. Here we go. Pull your abs in. Last one. All right, quick little shake out. Other side, that's it. Here we go. Keep those hips low. Last one. Recover, long recovery, grab some water.
All right. We're going to go into a combo sumo squat, sumo dead. So we're going to go open it wide. Toes slightly pointed out. We're going to go deadlift into sumo squat. We're going to drop it down. And we're going to hit straight leg bicycles for our abs. So we're back to leg ab, leg ab, okay? All right. So keep those legs nice and wide. Start with that deadlift, flat back down. Here we go. Just tap, squeeze that quarter, and then squat. What happened to your abs? Pull them back in. Finish that. Drop it down. All right, your option is to keep one heel down or hover. Come on up and switch. So slow and controlled here. Tap your knee with your elbow. Last one. Bring it up. So we'll take those bicycles really slow. Back to legs. Here we go. Deadlift, squat. Abs super tight. Squeeze that quarter. Last one. Finish it, drop it down. Super slow, here we go. Last one. So really squeeze it up and try to hit your elbow to your knee rather than knee to elbow. Here we go. Finish it. Drop it down. All right, get ready. Super slow. Get that twist, shoulder blades up. Scoop the belly. Last one. All right, last round, guys. Strong till the end. Here we go. Finish it. Come on down, last set of bicycles. Here we go. Slow and controlled. Last one. Nicely done. Minute recovery, grab some water. All 
All right, guys, pretty self-explanatory on this next one. We've got a glute bridge and a weighted sit up. Nothing fancy. You could definitely throw a glute band on and hit an abduction at the top. I'm gonna go for some weight on uh, a set on with my legs. And then if the weighted sit up is not happening, uh, you can go a weightless sit up or a crunch. You could also do a weighted crunch. All right. Tuck those shoulder blades, dig your heels in and pick it up. Here we go. Tap and go, don't hang out at the bottom. Squeeze the corner at the top, get those hips up. Last one, hold it, release. So the weighted sit up, it's a little bit easier if you hold it up here, it's a little bit harder if you put it on your chest. Here we go. Finish that one. All right, just stay down. I'm gonna double up my weight here. Here we go. Last one, hold it, release. All right, back to our sit-ups. Here we go. Scoop the belly, come up vertebrae, come down vertebrae by vertebrae. Last one. All right, get your weight ready if you're using it. Dig those heels in, tuck your shoulders. Let's go, get those hips up. Last one, hold it, release. Get ready, here we go. Finish it. Awesome job. We're down to our last round here. Here we go. Squeeze that quarter hard until the end. Last one, release. All right, guys, last set of abs here. Strong till the end. Here we go. In the shit. Nicely done. Long recovery, grab water.
All right. All right, guys, if you've got your glute band, go ahead and slip it on. We're going to use it for our next couple rounds. We're going to stay down here. First move, we're going to go into some clamshells. If you don't have a band, just set a light weight right here against the outer side of your knee. And this is the one where we open it even just a couple of inches. Your range of motion with the band is going to feel really small. Then we'll flip it over and do butterfly crunches. So we'll go leg, ab, leg, ab, okay? Okay, thank you, son. Glue those heels together. Here we go. Also, this arm, don't sink. Push out of the ground, abs tight. Your outer glute should already be fired up. Last one, flip it over. All right, I'm just gonna slip the band down, let your legs fall open and crunch. Reach for those heels, get the shoulder blades up. One more. All right, flip flop that clamshell. Glue those heels together. Press out of the ground, open it up. You should be feeling it right here. What happened to your abs? Pull them back in. Last one. Okay, open it up into your butterfly. Reach for those heels. Let's go. One more. Nicely done. Back to side number one. Do those heels, let's go. Press out of the ground here on this arm. Don't let it sink. What happened to your abs? Pull them back in. Last one. Open it up. Okay, reach for those heels. Let's go. Get those shoulder blades up. Last one. All right guys, side number two. Last time here, glue those heels together. Support yourself nice and strong. Let's go. I've gotten so much stronger on these. I hope you guys have too, because this is such an important exercise. Pull your abs back in. Last one. Nicely done. You can go ahead and uh, just remove the band. We will see it again next though. Here we go. Reach for those heels. Scoop the belly. Last one. Nicely done. All right, you can stay right where you are and just breathe it out on the floor. If you'd like to grab some water, go ahead and do so. We are gonna stay down for the next round. All 
All right, we've got all glutes this round. We're gonna go leg, uh, one exercise, leg, leg, second exercise, leg, leg. <laughs> we've got uh, donkey kicks. That's where we stamp our foot right up on the ceiling. You can absolutely put a weight behind that knee. Move number two, fire hydrant. We open it out to the side. Same thing. If you don't have a band, grab a light weight and stick that behind your knee. All right, pick a side. Doesn't matter which side. Let's start with our fire hydrants because they are harder. So let's dedicate more energy. Okay, support yourself nice and strong. Flex that foot, open it up to the side. Stay square to the ground. Last one. All right, quick little rest. Take that to the other side. Support yourself nice and strong. Go, flex that foot. If you have a weight behind your knee, crush it, hold it super tight. Pull your abs in. One more. Quick little shake out, back to leg number one. This time, donkey kick. Support yourself, abs tight, flex that foot, stamp it on the ceiling. Squeeze that quarter. One more. Nice. Okay, side number two. Donkey, abs tight, press out of the ground. Flex that foot, let's go. Squeeze that quarter. Last one. All right, shake it out. We're back to fire hydrants. Support yourself, flex that foot, let's go. Out to the side. Okay, thank you, Sam, go on. One more. Okay, go on guys, go on, I'm almost done. Okay, side number two. Let's go, out to the side, flex that foot, abs tight. Last one. Oh, those are burning. All right, donkeys, last round here. Okay, go on, go on, go on. thank you. Here we go. No, Gilly, go on. No. Squeeze that quarter, pull your abs back in. Last one. All right, guys, side number two, that's it. Flex that foot. Abs tight, support yourself, let's go. Squeeze that quarter till the end. Last one. Oh, nicely done. Remove that band, we are done with it. Woo. Jelly legs, get some water. All 
All right, guys. Last round here. We're gonna drop it down. We've got inner thigh lifts, hundreds. Inner thigh, hundreds. This is our last round. Okay, bring it down. So flex that foot, toe down, heel up, focusing on the inner thigh. All right, pick a side, any side. Support yourself strong. Here we go, three, two, one. Healy, go on, go on guys. Good, get a nice quick pace going. Two, one. All right, let's hit our hundreds. So you can keep your heels down and just peel the shoulder blades up. We'll do that for round number one. Pump the arms nice and strong. Keep a little bit of space in between chin and chest. Three, two, one. Okay, other side, inner thigh. Support yourself nice and strong. Toe down, heel up and go. Remember, it's quick. Abs tight. Three, two, one. All right, back to our hundreds. You can keep your heels down or take them out 45, peel those shoulder blades up and go. If you're here, it helps to squeeze your legs together. Three, two, one. Let's go back to side number one and see if we can add a little bit of weight here. Toe down, heel up and go. So that weight is just set right on my inner thigh. Last one, release. This time, let's stick one leg out. Okay, here we go. And let's elevator it. Down and up. Strong pump in the arms. Three, two, one. Remember what leg you just did. Add that weight if you did on side number one. Toe down, heel up, let's go. Last round. Three, two, one. All right, other leg, shoot it up, peel the shoulder blades up, let's go. Three, two, one, that's it. All right, guys, bring yourself up, grab water if you need to, and let's cool it down. Cool it 
we have reached the end. Time to cool down. All right, step tap, nice and slow. Good, nice big deep breath. Four, three, two, and grapevine. Deep breath in. Four, three, two, back to the step, half for eight. Four, three, two, grapevine. Two, step tap, cut it in half. Four, two, two grapevines. One more time, step tap for four. Two grapevines. Pause the feet, goal post arms and twist. Four, three, two, pause the arms, take the feet wide, hip thrust and hinge. Hold this one down. Bring that over to one side. Take that through center, other side. Back to the center. And roll it up, heel toe it in. Take a quad stretch. And take that into a standing figure four. Push that knee open, flex that top foot. Good, drop that foot right behind you into a shortened lunge. Tilt the hips forward and get a nice hip flexor stretch. Good, release quad stretch, other side. Take that into your standing figure four. I'm gonna hold it on this side just a little bit longer. This is my bad side. Good, drop that into our short lunge. Tilt that hip forward and come down just a couple inches, stretching into your hip flexors. Good, let that go. Deep breath in, cactus. Get a nice ab stretch here. And hinge, roll it up, do it again. Deep breath, cactus, hinge. Let's do that one more time. Deep breath, cactus, big ab stretch, and hinge. Deep breath in, do a dance, pose. We are done, round of applause. All right guys, thank you so much for joining me. Hopefully you liked the Tabata style. I like Tabata style. Uh, we will do it again tomorrow morning for cardio and core only. Uh, so I will see you tomorrow morning at 7.15-ish. Uh, have a great rest of your evening and I'll see you tomorrow.